Hi guys, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to generate a sitemap online, upload it to your website, and then submit it to the Google Search Console so that your website can be indexed. Now the first thing we need to do is pick a generator tool. Now I like to use XML sitemaps generator and I'll put a link to this website in the description so you can pick your own online generator service. Click the link and it will take you to xml-sitemaps.com. Simply enter your site's URL into here. So my website is websplaining.com and click start. Now just wait a few seconds while the website crawls your website. Okay, and it's completed. Click view sitemap details. And here's your generated XML sitemap file. Click the download button and it'll download into your downloads. So click show in folder here. And here it is. Now what you want to do with this sitemap.xml is upload it to your website. So I use AWS web hosting services. You might use HostGator or GoDaddy. So click the websplaining.com bucket and it will take you to the directory of your website with all your files. Click the upload button and then drag your sitemap into the directory and click upload and this will upload your file. As you can see the sitemap.xml has been uploaded. Now go back to the sitemap uh, website and it will give you the next step in what you should do. So it says upload it into the domain root folder of your website which we've just done then open Google Search Console and add your sitemap URL. So there's a nice link to the Google Search Console. Remember, you need to have a Google account before being able to log into the Google Search Console, so make sure you have one. If you do not have one, I'll put a link in the description of how you can create a Google account. So once you're in the Google Search Console, you want to pick your domain name or your property, whatever you are indexing for. As you can see, I'm going to be using websplaining.com. Scroll down to the indexing section and click sitemaps. Now, what you want to do is type the URL location of your sitemap. So for me, it's http colon two slashes www.websplaining.com and then you want to put your sitemaps location. So for this you want to go slash and because there's a bug on Google currently you want to put another slash sitemap.xml and then you want to click submit. So you're submitting your site now to your sitemap to the Google Search Console and let Google do its work. And there we go, the sitemap submitted has been successful. Click got it. Let me just click got it here. And as you can see, the sitemap.xml file submitted today status is a success. Now, this is great because now Google will be able to index your website a lot quicker. Okay guys, that concludes the video. If you have any questions, please leave it in the comments. If this video was helpful, give it a like and subscribe and see you on the next video.